fractals. It's the latest oh, one. Oh, yes. Written. And because it's unique and, and you get these beautiful uh, images, these, these, this is artwork of God. No human being drew these, these amazing uh, images. They're built into numbers by the creator of numbers. And there's no secular explanation for that. It's a devastating argument against any kind of non-Christian worldview. It's the biblical God that's responsible for those shapes. They're, they're gorgeous. They're, they're mind blowing. And uh, I, I think that's just a fun resource. And when I do a talk on that as well. And most people say okay. that's their favorite. That's their favorite. So. Of, your talk, of your talks. Yeah. Tell us, give us a couple of minutes of what a fractal is and what and how it becomes a picture. It's like so, you're showing me. Yeah. So a fractal is any shape that when you zoom in on it, it contains smaller versions of itself, okay. either exact or approximate versions of itself. Mm -hmm. And they're found in nature, but the, the really interesting ones are found in math. When you when you plot certain sets of numbers on a on a two-dimensional grid and you see which numbers belong to this particular formula. And the book ex explains how the formula works and so on. It, you, you, it, you get a map and the perimeter of the map is is fractal. It's it's, mm. it's beautiful. It contains smaller versions of itself. And the amazing thing is there's an infinite number of smaller versions on itself. So you can zoom in and there's a little baby version of the original and you zoom in on it and oh, it's got a little baby and you zoom in on it and you can do that the rest of your life and they go on infinitely. Wow. So it gives you a little glimpse into the mind of God. And uh, and if you get the book too, um, you get the software that's used to, to plot and explore these shapes. Oh, so, okay. Uh, yeah. So you can sit home on your computer and, and explore these shapes. It's not something the computer's creating. It's something that has always existed in mm -hmm. the abstract world of numbers. It's always been known to the mind of God. Yes. And it's just computers are now fast enough. We can explore these shapes rapidly. It's all, there's always been no excuse for doubting the biblical God, but how much mm -hmm. more so today when we have yes. these amazing resources? I mean, no one was expecting that there would be beauty built into numbers, but it's there. Right. And it's the Christian worldview that can make sense of that. And so I'm happy to share that with folks. It's, it's, a, it's something most people have not heard about. Mm -hmm.